Hello everyone, welcome to Aaron's Collecting and Detecting, coming back at you with another video. Uh, today's video is going to be a little different. Um, I'm not showing you part of that collection. Um, I did go to stop at uh, Walgreens today and voila, they did actually have a Fairfield pharmacy box. Um, they don't have pharmacy boxes at Rite Aid or anywhere else. Walgreens pretty much the only place around here that sells them. So they don't sell them at Targets, um, they don't sell them at Meyer. they don't sell them at uh, Walmart. So for me, Walgreens is the only place you can get them. And um, they'd happen to have one, and somebody had hit it in the back behind a bunch of stuff, and I found it. So, yes. Um, so we're going to open that. Well, I already opened this already. But every card is still in there. I did kind of put them in a little bit of an order. So I, let's see if you guys notice what the order is. Um, there is a method to my madness, though. Um, but uh, I put them in separate little sections um, just because that's what I do. I organize when I look at cards. Um, I'm not that way with everything, but cards, I definitely am. Um, so yeah, if if, it, if I sound upbeat and energetic, um, it's because I am. I had some good sleep and I'm not feeling tired at all. And um, I will say this uh, lady that's in my life has been a breath of fresh air that I badly needed. Um, like I said, she's been someone in my life for the past, I've known her for the past 20 odd years. And... I just happened to find her on Facebook by accident. Um, I was messaging another friend of mine, and she left had a, left a comment on one of her of her, uh, uh, her pictures up there, and like I said something to her. She messaged me back, and we've been talking ever since, like pretty much every day. And yeah. Um, digging her and things are going good and um a happy camper um because not to say I was sad but I had my good days and my bad and you know after you know the ex left and they were all bad for a while and then I uh you know started doing these videos and that helped I got on Facebook and reached out to some people and that helped um, but I've just really been pretty upbeat the last month or so, and yeah, it's been going really good. So, um, on that note, uh, I had some ham, ham steaks today with some mac and cheese and some green beans. It was good. Um, and yeah, so that's my day. Um, Thursday she's supposed to come over and we're supposed to hang out maybe go out to eat somewhere and then I have my friend coming over on Friday um, and yeah so life's going good but anyways that's not what you're here for most of you are here to see some cards and uh, I just you know tell you about life and what's going on a little bit so we'll see what's in here give me a second and I'll pull it I'll pull it out and I'll Show you everything. Um, yeah, just to show you, um, these are different from the last time I got them. They used to have the date they were packaged, and as far as I can tell, it doesn't say that because none of those numbers make sense. Before it would like say January of 2019. And it doesn't say that, so I don't know when this was packaged. I don't know why they changed that. Um, maybe they caught on to something that I'm not aware of, but, and also too, this used to say one in eight contains a hit. I mean, one in six contains a hit and now it's one in eight. And they also didn't say, look for randomly inserted cards, packs, parallels, autographs, and more. They didn't, it didn't say that on there. Um, and also it doesn't say how many's in here. So I don't know. I'm assume probably like, um, 80 or so, like how it was before. Um, but who knows? 
Um, I'm going to show you the pack first, and as you know, the packs that I get from these, I'm um, sitting aside for my, if I ever get my 500 subscriber, I will give all these packs away. So I have about, I'd say about eight or nine packs right now, and this is a 91 Series 1 Donruss. That's the pack, and these are, these, this was uh, $4.99, by the way. So, I'll show you what I got. First card, 2018 Bowman, Jackson Stevens. Another 2018 Bowman, Nick Williams. Another 2018 Bowman, Anthony Banda. Then I got a 2015 Bowman, Josh Reddick. Then I got a 2005, I, or wait, I think this, no, this is 2004 Bowman Draft. Bowman Chrome Draft, Mark Robinson. That's a cool looking card, even though I don't know who that is. Um, this is a Chris Basio rookie. So I, as you can tell, I put all the rookies together. This is a 1997 Leaf. Luis Castillo rookie. This is a 1997 Donruss Glendon Rush rookie. A 2007 Fleer Travis Chick. Never heard of him. Rookie. This is a 1990 Donruss Mark Gardner rookie. Um, this next one is a 1991 line drive pre-rookie Brian Dorsett. No relation to Tony Dorsett, at least I don't think so. I would probably guess not. Then this is a 1987 um, glossy update Charles Hudson. And the glossy set's worth more than the regular set, by the way. And this next one is a 1994 score traded uh, Chris Sabo with the Orioles, which is weird to see. Then here's some 2019 tops. Yes, Mario, Mario Petit. Don't know if I said that right. Steven Souza Jr. Joe Panic. And a Nick Birdie rookie. So I had the, all the 2019s together. Then here is a some of the star cards. A 1991 Fleer Will Smith. Will Clark. Will Smith. Yeah, that's funny. Another 1991 Fleer Will Smith or Will. I said Will Smith again. Will Clark. 1991 Donruss, Tim Raines. Oh, and this one's for hats. There you go, hats. A 2006 Topps Gold Cup, Brian McCann. I don't know if I already sent you one or you already have one of those, but if you don't have it, I will set it aside for you. And I'll even set it aside for you if you want another one. Um, This is a 1997 Donruss checklist. Tony Gwynn. A 1998 Leaf, 50th anniversary, Mike Mussina. A 1997 Sports Fleer Sports Illustrated, Andy Pettit, Cyber Vision. A 1996 Tops, Mike Piazza. A 2007 Upper Deck First Edition Gold Carlos Delgado. A 1992 Score Randy Johnson. A 2018 Tops Carlos Carrasco. 
Um, now these are the cards, um, 1987 and before, but not 1987 tops because there's a lot of those. So here's a 1980 tops, Jim Sundberg. And these are these were uh, kind of hard to get back in the day. These are also the hard to get sets, the 91 Stadium Club. Then here's a 1986 Sport Flicks, Mike Scott, Venezuela, and Doc Gooden. It's another card there for you. Hats if you want it. Here you go. I don't know if I sent you this card, Hats, but look at this Jose Cruz. This is dev definitely a Hats McGee box right here. Um, Because Hats, his dad knew Jose Cruz, so... Jose Cruz is like especially important to him. You got an 86 tops Lamar Hoyt, an 87 uh, Don Russ, the opening day set. I believe that's what they're called. And a 1987 um, Don Russ Mike Laga. Then here's some cards that I don't have a ton of, so I'm going to put them aside. Uh, 2010 Upper Deck, Mike Pelfrey, 1996 Tops, Chris Hammond, 1992 Fleer, Phil, or Jack Clark, 1993 Stadium Club, Mike Stanley, 1991, Opeachy Premier, Scott Sanderson. 1995, Fleer Ultra, Shane Reynolds, another Astro. There you go, hats, couple. And then a 1992 Pinnacle, Pat Kelly. Then a couple Tigers, 1992 Fleer, Scott Livingstone. Uh, 1988, Don Russ, Pat Sheridan. Um, and then these are all the cards that are like I have a lot of, like the brands and the years. 1991 Fleer, Jack Clark. 1991 Fleer, David Cohn. 1988 Don Russ, Brian Holton. 1989 Don Russ, Tim Belcher. 1990 uh, Tops, Jeff Hamilton. 1988, score, Mike Marshall. 1988, tops, Ron Darling. 1988, score, Jack Clark again. 87, tops, Dave Stapleton. 91, Fleer, Chuck McElroy. Uh, 1992, Don Russ, Jeff Reed. 1991, Don Russ, Jim Eisenreich. 1993, Leaf, Reggie Jefferson. 1993, Upper Deck, uh, Fernando Benavides. No clue who he is. 1989, Don Russ, Steve Rosenberg. 1989, Don Russ, Benito Santiago. 1989, Don Russ, Tim Belcher. 1990, Tops, Mitch Williams. 1987, Tops, Tom Nito, Naito. 1988, Don Russ, Barry Lyons. 1988, Tops, Donnell Nixon. 1991, Upper Deck, Bob Walk. 1990, Don Russ, Curtis Wilkerson. 1988, score, John Christensen. 1991, Upper Deck, Chuck Malone. 1989, Don Russ, Brian Harvey. 1989, Don Russ, Jose Okendo. 1988, Don Russ, Rick Leach, which he is a... Um, went to U of M, played U of M football. He's 
he actually went around the same time uh, Kirk Gibson played for Michigan State. They were kind of rivals. 1987 tops, Mickey Brantley. 1987 tops, Carmelo Martinez. 1987 tops, Rick Cerrone. 1992 tops, Billy Hatcher. Speaking of Kirk Gibson, 1989 tops, Kirk Gibson. 1990, Upper Deck, Jeffrey Leonard. Wish that was a Ken Griffey Jr. card. 1990, Score, Sid Bream. 1989, Don Russ, Rich Yet. 1990, Upper Deck, Greg Briley. Another wrong Mariner. 1989, uh, tops, Darnell Coles, former Tiger also. 1989, Don Russ, Rex Hudler. And 1991, Fleer, Kevin Romine. So, not that great, not horrible, not great, just okay. Um, but I don't get those boxes um, to get anything spectacular. I mean, you might get a decent rookie here and there, or you might get a really good card every once in a great while. And like I say, you know, they're making it harder to get an auto or a relic or something in there. So I just get it just because there's you don't know what you're going to get, and it's only 5 bucks. So, um, so that's why I got it. But uh, just... Let me know what your favorite card it was in there. Um, let me know how you think I did for five bucks. Um, what do you think of Fairfields? All, I'm, I mean, I've heard all you guys, a lot of you guys, what you say about them uh, before, but I don't really remember. So I'd like to hear you guys comment again on what you think of the Fairfields. Like I said, I personally like them for the price. I know there really isn't much. Um, much value in there uh, as far as what the cards are worth but I like the fact the diversity they got all the different brands in there all the different names um, there's some surprising cards you don't even think about or you haven't seen and that you don't have because there's a few cards in there I don't have or I haven't seen so I like that um, but yeah so just let me know what you think and uh, tomorrow we'll get back to um, that collection I bought because we got uh, one small box, um, one one eight hundred count box, and another of the four pronged like big big huge boxes. So um, we still got a lot of cards to go from that collection. I just like I said I got these today and I figured I'd show you guys. And like I said I couldn't wait to open them. So my apologies. Um, yeah, like I said, if I get up to 500, which I really would like to, then I can give all those, all these packs away. But if you guys want to go slow about it, that's fine because I, I can gather up more packs. Because like I said, I got about eight or nine now, but we'll see. It depends on how many fair fields I find. Um, yeah, I'm going to let you guys go, but thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Um, you guys... Uh, be safe out there. Have fun. Spring's on its way soon, hopefully. And, uh, yeah, just do what you love and love what you do, guys. Have a good one. I'll see you later. Bye.